Namaste. The state of Andhra Pradesh has been witnessing a rise in vandalism, a rise in iconoclasm for the past more than a year since the Jagan Reddy government came into existence. It's very obvious that the, the uh, people of Andhra Pradesh are being denied their basic right to practice, their basic right of freedom of religion and faith. The belief systems of the people are hit on. Religious sites of people are actually damaged, demolished, vandalized. Priests are attacked. People of one particular uh, religion, one particular faith are being constantly attacked. Still, zero action taken from taken by the government. Who gave you this right, Mr. Jagan Reddy? You are elected as the chief minister of the state and you are, though you belong to Christianity, you have to safeguard the interests of Hindus, you have to safeguard the interests of Muslims, you have to safeguard the interests of Christians, you have to safeguard the interests of each and every person who is an Andhra Pradesh citizen. It is your basic primary responsibility. You are denying it. You are denying it. And now, continuously when attacks are happening and we from TDP are pointing out that this is what is happening in the state of Andhra Pradesh. Our, our beliefs are being tarnished on. Our, our idols are damaged, are vandalized. You, you know, I, I should say shamelessly you come out and say, shamelessly you come out and say that this is our work. You are actually targeting on us for your misdeeds and your wrongdoings. We never encouraged any sort of conversions unlike you. You have been encouraging conversions. Don't you know that conversion is anti-constitutional? Don't you know that? Still you have been continuously encouraging conversions. What is happening in the state of Andhra Pradesh today? For the past 12 months, 137 incidents, including the incident in Insingarai Kunda today. 137 incidents. Zero action being taken on the culprits. Not a single per culprit being punished till date. Still, you claim that you are here and today you put a press conference and claim that you are doing good for the people of Andhra Pradesh. In what way, Mr. Jagan Reddy? In what way are you doing good for the people of Andhra Pradesh? We have been asking continuously for CBI inquiry into it. We have been asking continuously for judicial inquiry into it. When the Antarvedi chariot was burnt, we asked. You said we have, you have given it for CBI. And it is a fake thing that you have said. Even till date, CBI inquiry has not been in, in, you know, initiated in that. What are you talking about? You are a fake CM. You are a person who believes in iconoclasm. You are a person who believes in targeting people of a particular religion, particular belief. And I don't go behind in saying that. Again, when we were in power, we safeguarded the interests of each and every religion, whether it was Hinduism, Muslims or, you know, Christianity, we safeguarded each and every person. If in case there was any, you know, uh, incident, untoward incident happening on other beliefs or other religions, our, our chief minister then, Mr. Chandra Babu Naidu Garu, went there personally, instilled confidence for the past so many days, for the past so many months, things have been happening, attacks have been happening, not a single place that you have gone and instilled confidence in the people? Why? Have these people not voted for you? Are they not the residents of Andhra Pradesh? Are you not the chief minister for all these people? Or are you chief minister only for a particular sect, a particular community, a particular religion? Mr. Jaganadi, you need to answer all this because the people of Andhra Pradesh are asking you the questions. Why are you acting as a unconstitutional body sitting there why are you encouraging things that are unconstitutional why are you not punishing people who are attacking the you know the religious sites of uh, uh, people why are you not punishing them who gave you the right to in fact do all this we don't we are not questioning your faith we are not questioning your religion we are not questioning your belief system you believe one uh, faith and religion, I believe one faith and religion, I respect yours and in turn you are supposed to be respecting mine. And because you are sitting there as the chief minister, definitely you have to safeguard our rights, you have to safeguard our right to freedom of religion and faith and you have failed in doing so. And shamelessly, today you have cornered our TDP Karyakartas, 1300 and odd cases booked on us for actually highlighting your wrongdoings and misdeeds. Everywhere, everywhere, wherever there is a misdeed committed by you and your men, when we highlight the issue, you are in turn targeting us. But still, let us warn you, we are not going to go behind. We are very stronger because we work for people and we will never go behind. Because people are our power and we will definitely, definitely 
will not spare you for all the wrong things that you are doing in the state of Andhra Pradesh and this religious violence that has been actually propagated by you in the state of Andhra Pradesh. I don't know what could be the reason. Probably you are encouraging conversions. Probably you, are, you, you don't want any other faiths and religions to be staying in the state of Andhra Pradesh. I don't know why. But you are encouraging religious violence. And we are not going to tolerate this anymore. Definitely you have to start acting. You do not have an option but to start acting. Stop blaming people. Stop blaming the opposition parties. Start acting. Go punish the individuals who are actually targeting others, other beliefs and religions. Go do it.